All right, we're live. We're live, once again, capital L-I-V-E, here at Gravity and Oxygen Fitness, both are in Tone, Florida, USA Earth, Milky Way Galaxy, on election day. Very special day for us Americans. Uh, don't forget to exercise, see what I did there? You're right to vote today, okay? So we've had an incredible, incredible run of Turf Talk Tuesdays leading up this past Saturday to our Decaween uh, event, massively successful event. And coming to November now, it's all about being thankful, grateful for our health, grateful for family, grateful for being alive. And um, we want to be able to give back to our community as that is one of our five core values here at Gravity and Auction. I'm alongside today a very special guest. It is my mom, Miss Dottie Christopher. How are you, mom? I'm well, thank you. And you? I'm doing well. Thank you for coming and joining us on Turf Talk Tuesday today. It's only fitting in about time we had you on here, right? Well, thank you. I'm happy to be here, and I thank you for letting me participate. My pleasure, Mom. And uh, today's theme is uh, being thankful and giving back through fitness and community. So my mom had this inspiration of this incredible idea, um, understanding these are uncharted times with the global pandemic, that there are many families that have been affected due to the virus, where many families, uh, many uh, parents have been laid off or furloughed at their current workplace, which leads to diminished revenue um, and income to the point where themselves and their children are having a tough time being able to feed their family. So my mom had this heartfelt idea of doing something as a food drive with the Salvation Army, is that correct? Absolutely, Salvation Army. So when my son, Kobe, was born, you wanted to figure out what your name was as part of being his grandma, correct? Right. And what did you choose, Mom? Um, the Italian, Nani. So Nani. So my mom goes by Nani by my son. It's adorable, it's beautiful. Even though you're full Irish, you love the Italian last name, or grandma name, it's still adorable to love. So, you had the idea of a food drive at the Salvation Army during the month of November for Thanksgiving holiday. We think of it as fitness for the heart and the soul. Wow, that's incredible. Well said. So, you decided to name this whole charitable effort, what do we call it? Nani's Food Drive. Nani's Food Drive. So, there you have it, guys. So, during the month of November, we're having an auction doing a food drive here at our facility in hopes of providing food for underprivileged families and those troubled by the pandemic, correct? Absolutely. Take no, it away. no children and their families should wake up and During November, during Thanksgiving, or ever, correct? Ever. But Thanksgiving, we have so we have something to be Let's get back. It's the least we can do. We, we consider what we are privileged and uh, we should be thankful and blessed for what we have and for uh, creating that destiny. But some people don't have that fortune honor, do they? No, they don't. We have very um, specific um, food products in mind. We're thinking protein, carbohydrates, vitamins, and hydration. Okay, well, let's talk about the specific items that the right. Salvation Army is requesting. Right. So what do we have here? Okay, we're looking at meats. We don't want perishable items or anything in glass because they will go bad or be broken. But meats, tuna, chicken breast, spam, Vienna sausages, anything in, the, in that line. Beef stew, also. Canned, meatballs and spaghetti, ravioli, etc., etc. So that's for some of the proteins. We're also looking at uh, your carbs, pasta. Now, very often um, the Publix or when Dixie will have four, four boxes for five dollars, so you can you know load up on those. The other things are rice, cereals, beans, all kinds of beans. Again, protein in beans. You like meat. We're looking for Evaporated milk, sweet condensed milk, 
those you can do. As far as cheese goes, you can't get the cheese in, in the dairy, you know, in the refrigerated aisle, but you can get macaroni and cheese. They were very, very happy with the boxes of macaroni and cheese. You know, the uh, macaroni and cheese with the goat in it. Uh, we're looking at um, tacos. We can't do a lot of bread because bread goes bad. We will put everything on the list uh, to guide you. Uh, certainly can't do some vegetables, absolutely necessary. Crackers, we don't want to load up with a lot of junk, but you know, healthy crackers. Tuesday, thank you, Mom, Noni, and uh, let's do some good here this month of November. Thank you, guys.